From there, we move our train to see how Fidelity Bank marked the end of the year 2017 after a full year of hard work. Staff and customers gather to enjoy themselves in a lovely atmosphere. Take a look. <music> Year ends are good times to take stock of successes made. And for Fidelity Bank, there's a lot to be thankful for. In addition to an impressive financial performance in 2017, the bank is celebrating major milestones attained in the last four years. And this year-end party is an opportunity to say thank you to those who made it happen. The man who's been driving the change and transformation for the past four years attributes the successful journey to the contributions of a strong and dedicated team behind him. We've had what we think is a very good year, not because it happened by accident, but we're pleased that this is the outcome of disciplined execution of strategies we set for ourselves four years ago. The results are beginning to show, but we are not even yet there. So we just thought we should come together, make this a major corporate event, because I don't even know which other platform would bring all these customers and stakeholders together to say thank you. So that's why we're here. It was a night filled with entertainment, and in a relaxed atmosphere, everyone enjoyed the comedy, dance and various performances from Nigerian artists. The composition of the management team of Fidelity Bank is an indication of the bank's drive towards inclusion and a strategy of reaching everyone has so far earned the bank awards, including fourth best bank in retail banking, SME friendly bank of the year, and best in mobile banking, all in 2017. The bank also hit 1 million mobile banking subscribers back in 2017 and is celebrating 20 years of superior private banking service in its 30 years history. All these feats showing accelerated growth in such a short time. 
For customers and stakeholders, they are confident they are in good hands. Fidelity is a bank I've done business with since 2003. So I've done business with Fidelity Bank for like 14 unbroken years. It's a bank that supports Nigerian businesses. They are very strong on SMEs and um, it's a bank to do business with. I love their service. I love their, um, I love the, the, the passion they bring to the relationship. And uh, it's, a biz it's a bank um, we've enjoyed doing business with. Well, I believe that um, it takes a team but that team must have a, a head. And the leadership um, that I see in Fidelity Bank is a leadership that transcends all levels. So there are various teams that make up the whole corporate. And um, they must all work together to achieve their strategic objectives. Pushing boundaries is not new to the man at the helm of affairs. And this for him, is a combination of hard work and commitment. A leader is that person, or a manager is that person who achieves results using others. So your ability to identify competent people, putting square holes, I mean square pegs and square holes, um, is a major skill. So everything we've achieved I attribute to the teamwork of my team members. My major work was to recruit these people or to reassign people in a manner that coordinates everything that we intended to achieve and that's why we're seeing this result today. This achievement is quite prolific in the sense that we have enjoyed the support of our customers, tremendous support from the customers, tremendous support from the customers, but more importantly, or equally important, is the hard work that the people of Fidelity have put into it. Today, we are certainly one of the leading banks in our category of banks. Fidelity Bank's performance so far is enough guarantee that there are no limits to what they can achieve in the coming years. And as their slogan says, we hope they continue to keep their word to their esteemed customers. pat yourself in the back if you've done so well. So well done to Fidelity Bank and a big well done to all of us who've seen the end of 2017. I pray 2018 will be way better. On that note, we end Metro File for today. If you enjoyed the program, please watch it again. Visit channelstv.com. Click on the playlist. Tell your friends about it too. And there's a Twitter handle on the screen. Please let's continue the conversation there. I'd like to hear from you. And for the number blinking there, just call to find out details about Metrofile. Let me, let me remind you again that Friday's edition of Metrofile gets repeated on Saturday by 12 noon and a new edition comes up on Sunday by 9.30 a.m. That one gets repeated on Wednesday at 11 p.m. Congratulations again once again to Channels Television. I sure will see you again very soon. Till then, take care of yourself. I'm Anne Mwawadu.